Hey YouTube, this is J-Mac with Atlas Overland. I recently had the good fortune to travel down the coast, the Oregon coast, with my good friend Brandon. And we tried all the chowder on the coast. At least it seemed like it. No, we tried about 13 cups of clam chowder. Uh, ranging from Depot Bay all the way down to Gold Beach, Oregon, where the Rogue River flows into the Pacific Ocean. Anyhow... I'm a little sick of chowder now, but at the time I was wholeheartedly devoted to uh, figuring out who had the best clam chowder, and my friend Brandon also provided some tasting notes. Hope you enjoy this video and watch more to find out who has the best clam chowder on the Oregon coast. This is James McMillan with Atlas Overland. Join me for off-road adventures, exploring beautiful places, in Oregon and in the West, and enjoying some great food. Please subscribe and like. These chowder reviews are strictly opinion of two people that tried a bunch of clam chowder. We're not experts, we're not paid by anybody, and it's all opinion, so take it with a grain of salt. Or a lot of grains of salt if your chowder sucked. Good beer, but terrible chowder apparently. My friend ate here and got sick. Wouldn't recommend the chowder. This chowder seemed to be made with powdered milk. It was very pungent and off-putting. Wouldn't recommend it. This chowder was way too thick and was gluten-free. Not a very good chowder, but it may be the best chowder in Gold Beach. Don't come to Jerry's for the chowder or their locally brewed beer. Do come there for really nice local experience some great domestics and craft beers on tap and a good game of pool at one of their two pool tables. Really nice people there. We enjoyed it. This chowder was way too oniony. Use a little less onion next time. Otherwise, good chunks in the chowder. At number eight, Portocal's chowder was right in the middle. Pretty good chowder, but nothing spectacular. Small chunks. Griff's on the Bay, also squarely in the middle at number seven. Good enough chowder with some decent chunks. Not the best. Griff's on the Dock in Port Orford was a milky chowder. Really tasty and some good chunks in it. The Beachcomber makes a solid classic clam chowder they also have a ton of taps, so this is a great place to go in Florence. The Abandoned Fish Market just edged out the beachcomber for classic clam chowder flavor. Lots of big chunks of potato and clam. It was a really solid clam chowder. The Crazy Norwegian's clam chowder was our number three pick. Really good with thyme in it. Lots of chunks of clam and potato and really friendly service at the counter. We really enjoyed this chowder. Number two in our tasting was Captain's Choice. In addition to making some of the best seafood in the Coos Bay area, they make a really solid classic clam chowder. Nice job, guys. Number one in our tasting was the chowder at the coffee house on the north side of Yaquina Bay in Newport, Oregon. Really good chowder with thyme and rosemary in it. Big chunks of potato, big chunks of clam. Perfect texture, super creamy and delicious. Really solid work and a friendly staff. Nice job. Purists out there may say the herbs don't belong in clam chowder. I think they made the clam chowders that we tried really nice. Even if you disagree, I hope you can gain some insight from our tasting notes. 
Also check them out on Instagram. Thanks. Bye. Here are Instagram handles. I gotta tell you, I won't be eating any chowder for a long time. My stomach definitely needs a break. But here are some other awesome eats that we saw along the coast. Barnacle Bill's Seafood Market. Delicious lump crab and smoked salmon. Local Ocean in Newport, Oregon. Solid food. This was my lunch. And then one of my friends also got some crab chowder. A little garlicky, but it was still delicious. Last but not least, the Langloy Market in Delhi in Langloy, Oregon. The best hot dogs on the coast, bar none. They also have a kombucha bar and a growler fill station. And now for the scenery. Hey YouTube, thanks for watching this video. Please check us out on Instagram. Those are our handles there. And please also subscribe and like. Thanks for watching.